I was there, and I'm <laughs> delighted to tell you that concert will be recreated on March the 5th, the exact anniversary. At the Ulster Hall today, we Died in the Wool fans took a walk down memory lane. I was 15 years old, and I was in rock and roll heaven. You Here I was watching the biggest group in the world playing in Are We Time. Why? I'm gonna give you my love. I'm gonna give you my love. Led Zeppelin decided to go back to the clubs and they do a club tour and the place. This was neither club nor major arena. That time they were capable of doing a 20, 30,000 people. And they came to the Ulster Hall and played to 1,200 people at one pound. And I think the money just covered the expenses. Some even got to touch their idols. I took it upon myself, which I didn't realise you didn't do that sort of thing, to come along and write a request out for Robert Plant and touch him, you know, walked up to the stage and he actually took it out of my hand and said, yes, I'll do this for you. And he, it must be on the bootleg tape, obviously, and he said, this is a whole lot of love for June and Rita. He sang to her, June and Rita! There's a lady who's sure All that glitters is gone Ah yes, that great anthem of rock, Stairway to Heaven, was played for the first time in public on that magical night. And to mark that anniversary, the entire concert will be recreated next month by the cover band Simply Led. Obviously to emulate probably one of the best live acts ever is quite a tough job, but um, we will certainly do our best. This is exactly where I was sitting to watch my heroes go through their paces on stage. You know, a famous rock philosopher once said, you show me the boy who never wanted to be a rock and roll star, and I'll show you a liar. Never was that more true than for me on that March night in 1971. Noel Thompson, BBC News, at the Ulster Hall. There's a lady who's sure all that glitter. You are a wee rock and roll star. I'll tell you, that guitar seen some action.